police service, we are pleased to support Schizophrenia Society of Ontario's National Schizophrenia and Psychosis Awareness Day, just as we support many other agencies that assist those members of our community who are affected by mental health issues or addictions. Community partners are critical to the way the Toronto Police Service helps make our neighbourhoods safe. For example, the Toronto Police Services Board Mental Health Committee engages partners across the spectrum of mental health, from consumer survivors to institutions to agencies and associations that support people with mental health issues in the community. These partnerships are vital in shaping the way the Toronto Police Service responds to those in crisis. The Schizophrenia Society has helped educate our officers about schizophrenia and how to respond to those affected by the affliction. And today, over 800 members of our, of our uh, service, police officers, have received this education. The service is grateful for the work done by the Schizophrenia Society, and we will continue to support the society and others who help those who are suffering from mental illness. Thank you very much. Thank you, Deputy Federico. It's my pleasure now to introduce a member of the Schizophrenia Society of Ontario and a young woman who lives with schizophrenia, Marie Asuncion. Good morning. I'm proud to support Schizophrenia Awareness Day. It is a passion of mine, and I'm willing to share my story to support this cause and to eliminate stigma one step at a time. My name is Marie Asuncion, and I was diagnosed with schizophrenia at age 15. Now, at 27, I'm thriving. I graduated from the University of Toronto with a Bachelor in Music, ran the Man Up 2010 Olympic Torch in Oshawa, have been teaching now for several years, and am living on my own. This illness does not define me. I reflect recovery, and I'm honored to represent the Schizophrenia Society of Ontario. Please support the work of the Schizophrenia Society of Ontario and Schizophrenia Awareness, because without them, People like myself will never be able to know what it is like to feel fully recovered. I'd just like to remind members of our community that the support for societies such as the Schizophrenia Society is so important in helping our community members uh, manage the challenges that they face in the community. And it is vital to help services like the Toronto Police Service deliver our, uh, our service to the community in a way that responds to the needs of our community members. So once again, thank you very much to the Schizophrenia Society for taking the initiative, and I urge everybody to proudly wear their purple robes. Thank you. Thanks for coming, ladies, today. I'm with Corporate Communications at Toronto Police. This is a live stream. <laughs> do, you get, do you guys have a message? Do you have a message you'd like to say about wearing purple today? How can people uh, hook up with you people to make the difference bigger? Thanks a lot. Well, you're going to go live to YouTube in one second here. <laughs> Thanks for making a difference. Thank you.